can't believe it. Forced back into the Knights of Seros. I'm sorry to drag you into this. It's okay, Father. I suppose they want you to do something too. They want you to work here as a mercenary. Nothing like all the things you're thinking. They just want you to teach here. Apparently, this place happens to be short of professor. And each class has a total of three professors. And the professor you're with. Oh, the three of you will be teaching all three classes. Oh, so you're the new professor. Well, guess I gotta get going. Watch out for Lady Rhea. I have a feeling she's up to something. I guess because you're new here, you're gonna need some of our help. My name is Manuela. I used to be a songstress in the Empire. And my name is Hanneman. I'm a crest scholar. Now, yours, Byla, a wandering mercenary. Very well then. We'll show you the real ropes. Rhea, are you sure we should have her as a professor? As I said, Sedith, I've already made my choice. But this is preposterous. Having a stranger as a professor, a child even. Are you sure this is a good idea? Sedith, I've already made my choice. As you wish, Lady Rare. Oh, hey, Barlas. Hey, Rhea. May I ask a favor? Yeah, sure. I would like you to get to know the students of the monastery. Hmm. Well, I guess it would be great to get to know everyone. Why, hello there, Professor. Hey, Edelgard. So... I hear that you're going around, get, trying to get to know all of the students. Well, I could tell you about them. Sure. Me. I'm the Imperial Princess. The third youngest child in the Perez Belk family. Well, that should clear for me. I'll move on to the others. Hubert von Vestra. He's my guardian. We met when we were young. And he's been protecting me ever since. Ferdinand von Eyer, the son of the Prime Minister of the Adrestian Empire. Caspar von Burglies is the second son of Count Burglies. He's a bit boastful, but in, deep inside him, he's a kind, caring person cares about others. Lindart von Hevering, a crest scholar. But he's always sleepy. But when he sees but when he's awake, he's always at his best. Dorothea von Amont, a songstress who can use magic. She's always energetic, and she always cares about others. Bernadetta von Varley. The only daughter of 
Count Barley. She is kind of like a timid bunny, but deep down, she's a kind soul, just very afraid. And Petra McNeary, the princess of Bridget. She is that kind of warrior type and is always willing to help others. That should clear up about just about everyone. All right, thanks. I'll go check up with either Dimitri or Claude. All right, see ya. <laughs> Oh, hey, Claude. Oh, hey, Teach. Just noticed ya. Let me guess. You're here for introductions. Well, I'll say yes to that. Me? I am the grandson of, of Count Regan, the ruler of the Lester Alliance. Lormans. Sorry about that. I just really can't really talk today. Just glad to know you're a professor. Oh, keep going. Lawrence Hellman Gloucester, the son of Count Gloucester. It's kind of, you know, always hated me in a sort of way. I don't know why. Hilda Valentine Gonderell, the daughter of Count Gonderell. She is very cooperative with me. But normally, she just likes to be chill over everything. Ignaz Victor, the son of a merchant family came here because he wanted to help other people. Raphael Kirsten, the son of a merchant family. And left here because he had nowhere else to go. Leone Penili, the one and only apprentice of the Blade Breaker, Gerald Eisner and she still fights in his name. Lysithia von Ordelia, the most talented woman in the Lester Alliance. A wandering mage who came across the monastery and joined as a student. Marianne von Edmund, the daughter of Margrave Edmund. Because of too much work, she got a little sleepy. But she's always kind and caring of others. And that's about it. So, all I have left to talk to is Dimitri. Oh! So you're talking to his princeliness or something. Well, see ya. Um... Hello? What do you want? Uh, I was just coming for introductions, but now that I've seen you, who are you? Hmm. I am Yuritsa. I teach here. Weapon instruction. Over here's the training grounds. Goodbye. Jeez. Some introduction. Another one? Who are you? Oh, I believe this is the first time we have met. I am Tomas, the librarian. If you are looking for the library, it is over there. Hmm? I finally found you, Link. Um, what? Sorry. I just forgot your name. I like, called you some random name. I'm sorry. N no, no, it's good. I'd be happy to tell you my name. But I know why you're here. Just want to know everyone in my class. I'll tell you. 
But before we get on to anyone else, I'll be happy to tell you who I am. Dimitri Alexandra Blazin, the prince of the kingdom of Fargus. Now, for the others. Dudu. He was born in Dusker. And he fights for the kingdom now. But mostly, he fights for me. I tell him to just follow his own path, yet he chooses to fight for me. Felix Hugo Fraldarius, the son of the Shield of Fargus. He's always eager to fight and is willing to help others improve. Ash Ubert, the adoptive son of Lord Lenato. He's a kind, gentle soul who's always into reading. Mercedes von Martritz, the kindest soul in all of the Holy Kingdom of Fargus. She's even willing to negotiate with the enemy, and she doesn't fight unless she has to. Sylvain Jose Gautier, the son, the youngest, of Margrave Gautier. He, he's a bit of an, um, this is awkward, skirt chaser or something. Uh, Ingrid Brandel Galatia. The soldier in our group. And it's always willing to fight. But she gets a little angered a bit, if you say some red thing to her that she doesn't really like. But other than that, she's a kind person. Annette Fantine Dominic. She's a mage in our group. always wants to fight for those she cares about. That is all. Goodbye, Professor. I will see you again. I guess I should report back to Lady Rhea. Going to her. Have you grown accustomed to the monastery? I see. Well then, it's our job to help you. We will guide you through everything. Just don't cause a ruckus, okay? All right, thanks. Hey, Sedith. Uh, Flane, I'm in the middle of a meeting. I'll talk to you later. Oh, so you're the new professor. I am Sedith's little sister. Flane, pleased to meet you. Hello. Well, I guess it is up to all of us to help you. All right then, I'll see ya. So this is my dorm room. Well, I guess I should get some rest.